Hi everybody, this is the big uh, rough draft meeting week. So the first thing you'll note is that you do have to complete worksheet number three. Ideally you will complete worksheet number three by Monday or Tuesday, but technically it's not due till Sunday. The reason I say to get it done is because you're going to need worksheet three to put into your paper. So you'll combine and look for patterns from worksheet one, two, or three looking for a pattern in say tone. So you'll look and say, okay, had a sarcastic tone in this article and this article, but maybe not so much this article, so I need two examples. So I'm going to use these as my two examples of a sarcastic tone uh, in this paper. Um, so a lot of times you'll see a pattern in all three and you'll just be able to choose out of two of the articles which are the uh, most outstanding examples. Um, you can choose audience out of any of the examples, but you want to complete worksheet three before you actually finalize your rough draft. So you'll finish that, and then you're going to sign up for either Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday a time. There are Google times on my Google Calendar that if you click on that date, you only have to sign up for one. It is not required that you sign up for anything. However, um, the first thing I'll check, or no, because I would have met with you, uh, if you have issues with what grade you earned on the first paper is did you have a conference with me? Did we have a chance to talk over what you did? And it'll be a Zoom meeting about 10 minutes, 8 to 10 minutes long. Um, if it takes one minute, then it takes one minute. If it takes 9 to 10 minutes, that's what you need. Um, you can sign up for more than one, but you want to make sure there's enough space for everybody in the class. We can also schedule a time if you're looking at those three days and a time is not available for you on um, any of those three days that really works for you. Um, let's say you work during the day on all three days and you need a night time. We can arrange that, but you have to email me for that. Um, after Wednesday, um, we won't be doing Zoom meetings anymore conferencing. So what you do on those days um, is you'll choose one day, Monday or Tuesday or Wednesday. You'll choose a time that works for you. You'll, there'll be a Zoom meeting call and a code for you to get in, um, or WebEx, it doesn't really matter which, they're both equally the same. Um, I will send that, I will have that li listed in our classroom, and then you can click on it. I can look at your paper if you want, you can ask me questions. This is a time for you to get what you need to get the best grade on your paper. Um, to make sure you understand if there's part of the rubric that you're like, I, I don't know what you're asking here, or I don't know what a worldview is. I've been struggling with this and I need your help. Um, and I can help look at your uh, worksheets and kind of talk about things and ways you can find that. If after our 10 minute session, you're like, I need some more help, uh, or I barely got started and now I've started writing my rough draft and I have questions, certainly we can talk again. Um, and as I said, you're not required to sign up for the rough draft conferences, but um, they are the most advantageous way to earn the highest grade you can. It gives you a chance for a little interpersonal connection with myself as well. Um, so you'll sign up for that and then on Friday you're going to post your rough draft of your paper. And this rough draft is only for peer review. Our conferences are not for me, uh, I mean are the time that I can give you feedback and help you with your paper. Um, I never edit papers, like you send it to me, don't send me your paper and say hey, could you uh, look through this and see if I got everything right and then send it back to me. Um, that doesn't really help you learn, it just helps you make corrections. We have the Writing Center that can help you with editing and they can look at your rubric. You can sign up for an appointment. I have it attached at the top of class, how to have your virtual appointment with the Writing Center. Um, and if you struggle with grammar or writing at all, um, they're a great resource and you can say, this is the rubric she gave us, and this is what I've written, and this is the feedback she gave me on my worksheets, and this is what we talked about. Um, I struggle with MLA, or I'm afraid of how to do a works cited page, and they'll help you with all of that. They will help you through. You can sign up for as many appointments as you want. Um, and then, like I said, Friday you'll post your rough draft. Um, I will grade you on did you post it, and is it a you know thorough enough rough draft that you didn't just post a quick outline, but it's an actual paper. And then the real grade will be on your feedback you're giving to your classmates. And I've included some um, scaffold on, scaffolding um, for that, what you should write, how you should write it, what things you should look for in your peer review. And then you'll post a response to someone by Sunday. 
So Friday, the rough draft is due. Sunday, you must have given at least two classmates feedback. Because the next week, that's when our paper's due, the final paper. So um, good luck, and I hope you're enjoying this. I hope you're getting something out of this that um, maybe you thought, like, oh, I hate politics, but you're really analyzing someone's writing. So it really has nothing to do with politics or whether you like or hate the person you're writing about. Um, and i looking forward to seeing you this week during our conferences. So good luck. Get to writing.